We are back with Mimi, sorry, Mimi, Janet, and Kathy Lennon, otherwise known as the Lennon sisters. And we want to chat a little bit, but first we want to listen. Yeah. Okay. okay. Do you guys quick, mind starting sisters? us off in, in is, song and then we'll come back in? This is when we did it. many, many years ago. You ready? Right. Here they are, the Lennon sisters. Well, well, sugar in the morning, sugar in the evening, sugar at supper time. Be my little sugar and love me all the time. Honey in the morning, honey in the evening, honey at supper time. Be my little honey and love me all the time. Now sugar time, sugar time is any time that you're near. That you're near, cause you're so dear. So don't you roam, don't you roam. Just be my honeycomb. Honeycomb, honeycomb. We live in a heaven of love. Sugar in the morning, sugar in the evening, sugar at supper time. Be my little sugar. And then we're, we're going to do a song that meant everything to Daddy, the way he loved to hear us sing, and a couple of old spirituals. It's our favorite harmonies. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Nobody knows my sorrow. Oh, nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Glory, hallelujah. Sometimes I'm up, sometimes I'm down. Oh, yes, Lord. Sometimes I'm almost to the ground oh yes Lord nobody knows the trouble I've seen nobody knows but Jesus oh nobody knows the trouble I've seen glory Sometimes I feel like a motherless child. Sometimes I feel, sometimes I feel like a motherless child. Sometimes I feel like a motherless child. A long, long way from home. A long, long way from home. Long, long way, a long, long way from home. Sometimes I feel like a motherless child. Wow. That is amazing. Did you guys? Did you have formal training, like go and learn how to read music. Read music. We don't you don't read music. Read music. It's music? all by ear, and it just goes through the whole family. <laughs> wow, that's me. That blows my mind. Yeah, yeah. yeah. no, no we don't. All right, so tell us about this weekend coming up. It's a special weekend for your family. Yeah, we're excited on Friday and Saturday, June 21st and 22nd, in Santa Monica at the Women's Bay Club, a whole historic building. We're doing a Lennon Family third annual benefit concert. And it's the Lennon sisters, the Lennon brothers and Gail Lennon. It's Venice. It's cousins. There's about 30 of us cousins and children and nieces and nephews all sing and praise for. We have the uh, benefit for the brain, B-R-A-I-N, which is for brain injured people. We also have my stuff bag is for foster children for things for them to have. We also to help build the historic where all our parents danced during World War II and wrapped bandages for the war and all. And then for our cousin Lori who has recently had breast cancer and is to raise money for the awareness of breast cancer. So the benefit is our whole family and we're very excited about it and there's plenty of tickets so we'd love that.
Wow. Any uh, any of the spouses sing? Oh, they'd be a little intimidated. Actually, to get up there with you know thing. what? Oh, my husband yeah. John, I could go. We could do a whole show on him. He sung <laughs> yeah. on every movie commercial theme oh, really? song for yeah. Happy Days, and you know, Good forever. He's John quite Taylor. a singer. Yeah. Well, you know, yeah. Speaking of legendary figures, you know, Woody's a little bit of Woody Fraser, <laughs> oh, our, our producer, him. is a little bit of a legend around well Hollywood. Our family. Well, your family in particular too. So tell us how the far connection. back you have the connection with Woody. We met Woody back in 1962 when Mike Douglas had his local show in Cleveland, Cleveland Ohio. Right. And he used to have hosts that hosted all week. So we would be on all week and Woody was the producer and of course you know. He loves to have fun, and we had some great have, games that he, he, he had to, us he play. He used to surprise us. He used to have us come and be, all of a sudden bring somebody on and say, you, I bet you couldn't do this. Well, he knew that Daddy would not allow us to throw footballs like a girl, and we were the four <laughs> oldest, so we were his sons, and he made us always throw football, baseball, do all that. Everything was about sports with Daddy. Well, Woody knew this. So we're standing there, and he says, I have somebody to meet for you to meet today, and he brought in Jim Brown, fabulous football player, yes. and he hung a, a tire at the very end, with the Cleveland Browns, yeah. hung a tire at the very end of the studio and said, you're going to throw this football in the middle. So we all look at each other yeah. like, oh my gosh. So Jim Brown starts. He misses the first two and then goes in the center. Janet hit it on the side. Peggy missed. I picked it up, the very first one, right through the middle. And then Daddy looked at Woody and Woody said, and there you have it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, as we step away, I would love it. Can you make it feel like Christmas in July while I take us to break? Do oh, well, let's mention yeah. the way you do just, Christmas real quick. Oh, yes. We're excited about, yes, let's do that. We're going to do that at, in Branson, Missouri, our 20th year with the Osmonds at, at the, the Andy, Andy Williams, Williams Moon River, River Theater. Theater. It's oh. a So have yourself a merry little Christmas now. Merry Christmas to you. Oh, the Lennon sisters to hear more of their music. June. Be sure to go out and buy tickets to their concert and go to our website or visit theirs, LennonSisters.com. Thank you guys.